Hello, everybody. Sorry about that. I had to adjust my mic. Uh, excuse me while I kick this beat. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it, it, oh man. Wow, I'm already losing my train of thought. Uh, been at work. Uh, anyway, just wanted to let you guys know, as I'm sure you all have probably noticed, uh, if you have read the title to this video, uh, my PlayStation 3, uh, caught what is most politely known as the red, uh, sorry, it almost called it the red ring of death, the red blinking light of death, uh, where it turns yellow for a small bit and then it, you know, starts blinking red for a little while, and there's really, once you get that, you're fucked. Uh, since I have one of the old 60 gig backwards compatible models, uh, I was unable to force eject the game I had inside. Uh, the game that I did have inside turned out to be Little Big Planet 2. So, uh, for the most part, the next couple walkthroughs, maybe the next couple ones, maybe after this one we'll be back to PlayStation 3, but as of right now, we are going to be playing, uh, mostly PlayStation, uh, 2 walkthroughs. Uh, especially this one here, and this is one of my favorite games on the PlayStation, if you have ever played this. We are going to be playing the motherfucking Punisher! Damn, Skippy bitches. Uh, let's take a look at this. Would you like to create save edit? Yes, I would. How did you know? Uh, see all those drawings in the background? Uh, yeah. That's pretty much what all of my notes in school look like after I started playing this game. When I was a freshman in high school, a buddy of mine, uh, everybody called Luigi, his real name was Rob, uh, we started, uh, we, we became very close friends, but he, uh, he, he said, would you like to borrow this game? And it, it, the game came out right after the Thomas Jane version of the Punisher movies did. And uh, pretty much what happened with that is that the Thomas Jane version of the Punisher movies was not very close to the comic books, I'd say. Uh, it had a couple similarities, but there were a couple little things that kind of threw me off because I knew the Punisher, Frank Castiglione, from a, uh, sorry, horrible Italian accent. Uh, I knew him from the comic books. Normal. And uh, I knew a lot about his background. So the movie threw me off just a little bit, but when this game, when I started playing this, it builds itself pretty much... Mostly off the movies, but I'm going to shut up because I don't have I subtitles on in this. But. I took enough bullets, but I lived. I finally figured out why. The graphics in this were awesome for fucking PS2. Hello, Rito Punisher. Bang! <laughs> he had one shot left. Let's do this. <laughs> Still got them bad boys, though. Good night, sucker. <laughs> this motherfucker's just a badass, dude. Yeah, when this game came out and I started playing this, I felt like a fucking G playing this, the ones man. Who killed my family, the Saints. I wanted that fucking coat so bad. I'm back. Booyah! Turn to die. I'd be doing that shit to people all day long in this game. Time to get moving. Still more to do. Takagi's taken care of, but others are harder to reach. But yeah, this is pretty much a movie game. It even uses the same insignia from uh, the Punisher movie that came out shortly before this. His skull looks like it does from that from that movie. The original Punisher skull was a little, I don't want to be mean, but it was a little bit gay. Uh, but, here, let's see if we can't turn on some motherfucking subtitles. Uh, game settings, gore level, high. Wow, you can either be none or just blood squirting out of asses. Uh, let's see, closed caption on, show tutorial messages, vibration. Oh, it's tingly. Hold on, I'll hold this up against my nuts. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, show stop points on restore default settings. Accept changes, yes. Oh, it's going to save my changes. How PlayStation 2 of you. Uh, base controls, audio, video. Let's see, the brightness. We're going to up it just a bit, because I know you guys should be complaining. How bright can I make it? 10? We'll set it at 4. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah we'll just say that for uh, but yeah, it, this pretty much follows the movie, and the movie didn't follow the uh, the comic books too well. But what I think they tried to do for this game is that they tried to make a more comic book uh, based game, and I think they did a great job of it. So anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at some extra stuff. Uh, extras and stuff is pretty much in this game. You will see I have comic book covers, uh, concept art, flashbacks. Flashbacks are badass. Uh, movies, trailers, cheats, stuff like that. Uh, I forget what some of the cheats are, but. Uh, war journal. War journal. We will be visiting. Uh, criminal chart. These are pretty much all the guys here that you're going to be killing. This is pretty much the number of uh, big badass motherfuckers that you'll be going after. Some of them you will catch. Some of them you won't because the Punisher doesn't always catch everybody he's going for. Uh, news clippings. This is if you make you know the big time news. Uh, but you know we'll, we'll be hitting up all that shit you know eventually. But currently we are in his lair. Uh, upgrades. They have a whole list of upgrades you can do. Kill recovery, body armor. But we'll take a look at that when the time comes. Uh, armory right now. I don't think we have anything. Oh, we have the pump action. Here, uh, yeah, if you hit X on it, he will give you a description of every gun. And I fucking love that, man. For when I want to get back to basics. This classic pump action has a pistol grip and a 14-inch barrel. Pistol grip pump on my lap at all times. No. Uh, <laughs> 45 cal semi-automatic. Classic design, one shot stopping power. The basic design of this pistol hasn't changed in nearly 100 years. The magazine carries only eight rounds, but that's eight kills. You could be fucking some people up with them guns all day long, man. To the war zone. Crack house, cause you know where else you gonna start when you're a badass motherfucker like me. You gotta start somewhere. We gonna start in the goddamn projects. There's a crack house near my apartment. You could use some cleaning out, and I could use some target practice. For shizzle, we're about to kick this pig, man. Start this bitch. The halos around dropped weapons show their ammo status. Blue means ammo is available. Red means no ammo. You can do some of the cheapest fucking kills of all time in this game, man. I fucking love this game, you have no idea. Franco Castiglione. That fat fucker. Welcome to Rikers, Mr. Castle. Look at this bitch trying to be scary. Fucking Ginger, you ain't got no soul. I'm a detective soap. This is Soap was in the comic books. He, he was actually Quite a time you've been having lately, eh, Castle? How many people have you killed in the last few weeks? Bitch, I've been playing Grand Theft Auto, you don't even wanna know. <coughs> and what were you doing in the Takagi building last night? Fucking your mama. Okay, let's go back to the beginning and see where the trail of mangled bodies leads us. A lawyer's been appointed for you, by the way. Let's chat while we wait for him. I love it when your lawyer shows up. So take us back. You'll know who weeks. it is. You're in the You're neighborhood crack like house doing what exactly? True believers. He's like, I don't know, Taking bitch. A bite out of crime, apparently. What was the body count? Man, I remember again? that shit. Scruff McGruff. Take a, yeah, take a bite out of crime. Damn, I'm having brain farts like a motherfucker today, dude. Use cover during firefights to preserve the Punisher's health. I love how they talk about him in the third person. Bitch, I am playing this game. It is me. Get the fuck out of the road, asshole! I love how I can hear him perfectly through the windows of that truck. Forget the things you heard about the place. That man has blue hair and green pants. New York. You know you in the hood now. <laughs> gun store, gun store, liquor store, gun store, liquor store, liquor store, gun store, liquor store. Park full of tourists. Damn, I want that coat. Real. The old New York is waiting just below. I wish I was that buff too. There's nothing to help you when the darkness falls. Love how he's walking with his shoulders all back and shit, like he's got his hands in his pockets. Doesn't even have pockets. The mayor chased away the monsters. Chased them to Brooklyn and the Bronx. Don't think this place has changed. Not in its heart. Not where it's asshole. And uh, we'll know in three weeks. Do not fall in New York City. No one's gonna catch you. Damn. He makes that place sound a lot worse than it really is, man. <laughs> I know there are some places in New York that will, you know, 
fuck you in a ditch and, you know, leave you there blind and crippled. But some places, you know, ain't all that bad. Use the left analog stick to move around. Use the right analog stick to look around. The scum I can do that. Need a wake -up call. Look at me go. The scum of the city need a wake-up call. I agree, Frank. The ship may look a little bit jank, uh, but this game is so much fun. I'm trying to remember. How do you leap? Can I even leap right now? No, but I can strafe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Strutting. Thriller. Thriller. No. Okay, sorry. And, uh. Oh, that's how you do it. The Max Payne dive. That bitch is just nasty. Ugh. There ain't no slow mo in this bitch, too, because when you leap, you gotta shoot and jump at the same fucking time. That is how you crouch to take cover. Let's go do this. Let's go, man. Use the options menu to customize the controls at any time. Hey, Yo, man, you got some crack? What you doing? What you doing? Come on, give Bitch. me a damn purse. Press X to grab enemies when you get close. Oh. It's good, sucker. Press square to kill and to kill your held enemies. Uh, most times he'll just hold them out front and blast them, uh, like with a pistol or something like that. But I like interrogating these motherfuckers. Uh, there is a point system in this game. Uh, but I will not be really caring a whole lot about it because I like blood and gore just as much as you do. So let's take this motherfucker. We are going to choke you this look bitch. You like you have something to tell me. Because it's easier. Let me go, you son of a bitch. Yeah, you gotta be delicate hey, with this. Well, not with these guys, because they crack. You like can't. That. I'm innocent. Innocent, innocent, innocent. He will say different things depending on if you killed him right now or if you lit him up uh, after they ha ever after he has a flashback like that. So we're gonna shield him and now listen to his response after the flashback. So were they. That'll teach so were they. See, it, it delves into his past a lot more than other games and other movies have. So, you know, uh, let's see. Press X to talk to the woman saving innocence to reward you with health. I like health. Hey, you're the Punisher. Thanks, man. Damn, lady. For, what? For saving my life. What the right. fuck? You got a fat ass on a rack like a shotgun. Damn, well, what the fuck? Oh, she gonna pee. Sorry, might as well let her slap. <laughs> fuck. No, please. The fuck? Damn, you got rocked. You killed him. Yeah, and you are next. Now where's the money? Where the money? I don't know. Only Bernie did. And you killed him. That room looks a lot and more no bright right now than it actually is when you get up there. Boom! Ah. Motherfucker. Larry, look, it's the fucking Punisher. Fuck yeah, oh, it's the shit. fucking Punisher. Hey asshole, come get some. Duh, oh, you made a mistake. Shit. We ain't scared of you. You fucking killed shit, Bernie. What if you really you knocked so Bernie's ass in a dumpster. <laughs> Motherfuckers, taking out the garbage. We don't do this. Stair dive. <laughs> oh, that was so jank. I gotta do it again. Dolphin le. Oh. Come on, Frank. Don't fuck it up. Yeah! <laughs> oh, fuck it. Oh, damn. What's going on? What the fuck's going on up in here? Ooh, you look like you know some shit. Come here, homie. Whoa! You about to get fucked up. We're going to face smash you. I'm trying to remember how to do this shit without killing him. Move the left, uh, move the left or right analog stick up and down to control the interrogation. The bar shows the enemy's life on the top and stress level on the bottom. To successfully interrogate enemies, hold the stress level in the orange zone for three seconds. You can beat them to death just for fun, uh, but I'll pull back on them and just wham! Cut that shit out. That's good, sucker. Damage runs it. He's up on the fourth floor. Damage runs it. Broken enemies reward you with health and info. <laughs> Excellent. We go shield this motherfucker. You can hold enemies for protection uh, from gunfire. You can also press triangle to knock out held enemies. Press L1 to throw them. Uh, if you just knock them out, uh, everything will be you know fine. Here, I'll just I'll let you guys you know just see what it looks like. He just whammos them. Uh, this next guy, though, is about to get pretty well fucked up, because I remember this guy. Hey, Maurice! Where the hell are you? What's good, bitch? <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Knocked your fucking Vulmer through your face. How you like that shit, bitch? Damn. How come... Uh, damn, I feel racist as a motherfucker. I've only killed black people so far. What's going on? Oh. 
Hi, baby.